Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Dress like Striker here. Welcome back to another episode of Mass Effect: The Legendary Edition, Chapter One. Look at you, you mother effer. All right, we just need to find this creature and determine what it, what it, Kila. What is that? Hmm. Don't know, but does it talk? Sing, perhaps? <laughs> ah, you ready, Garrus, for a plant boss fight? Just like the old times? Actually, that's from another game. <laughs> that does not look like any plant I've ever seen. This may be problematic. Yeah. For a plant, it's a really funky looking one. Opposite. It's a girl. Invaders, <laughs> your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. I'll destroy you all. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. Ah, why not? Doesn't it want a hug? I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them, now! No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Yeah, I remember you from Mass Effect 2. You're all green. <laughs> One shot. What the hell, Tally? You're supposed to be using your shotgun. These are zombies. Shotguns are really good for. Well, look at that. Look at that, Tally. Look at that. We are just. Destroying them. Is there anything else here? Do I shoot those? Weird. Oh my god, it's got a booby over there. When did this become Duke Nukem? <laughs> Quit running around in circles. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. We did stopped. I tickle you? Sure. We need to find more of these things. Hmm, I guess that one's dead. Mazel tov, that's another girl! <laughs> Man, this thing is just having- just keep- get, keeps giving birth? That's the same? Wake up. Now they wake up. They might wake up when we head out. Oh, what's the encryption here? How the hell did I always know this boy is gonna be square half time? <laughs> beep, 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 beep. Oh my god, another booby! Oh, I want to shot. Whoa, God. Think we got him, Commander. I think so too. 
Plant boss fight. I mean, it doesn't have to be bad. It doesn't have to be ours. Oh my god! What the hell was shot that was? She was getting ready to shoot her, uh, get ready to shoot her, uh, super at me and shot to the face. There was no saving that face. Look at that, it's always square. <laughs> this time it was all square. I'm just too damn good playing this so much. Now it's been remade for the PS4 to play some more. And to continue on for Mass Effect 4 when it comes out. Whoa, they all just died from that explosion. Let's sure focus on that. Boing. Shutting them down. It is hurting, Commander Shepard. We're on the right track. Mm. Spoopy. Spoopy. Okay, spoopy. Hello! Nice to see you! Oh, that got weird. Oh! Make up your mind, man. There. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I didn't expect my shotgun to push him over the edge like that. <laughs> Man, sometimes the rag dolls on here is what makes the game so... Oh, what are you doing? You hiding in the corner? Trying to camp? That's called cheating right there, actually. It's called camping. <laughs> That's it. Bag them and tag them. Yep. What the hell is this? Okay, so it's not this one. Oh god! Either I spent so much time um, doing side missions to make my character stronger, or I'm just a good shot. Why aren't you waking up? Is this the last, um. Uh... Yeah, I think this is the last tentacle. I guess he's gonna die. Yeah. Goodbye! Sayonara! Have a nice flight! Don't forget to ride! <laughs> Mazel she's been born again! <laughs> of course she's blue in this one. But... You get to meet her again in Mass Effect 2, and she's green. I... I suppose I should thank you for releasing me. <sighs> no, but a hug would be nice. Is everything alright? Are you hurt? I am fine, or I will be, in time. My name is Shiala. I serve... I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. Yeah, she did. And boy, was she hot, in my opinion. <laughs> Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. 
She tried to manipulate Seren, but in the end, her plan backfired. Ah. How is that possible? There's more to this. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel, an enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. Yeah. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of his existence. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. Built this city. Built this city under rock and roll. Built. <laughs> so the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the Cypher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. Meh. I need that knowledge to stop Saren. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Oh, Slow, God. deep breaths. Oh, my God. Let go of your physical shell. Uh. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind uh. us one to another. Oh, my God. Stay away from Every me. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Don't touch me. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Oh my god. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Oh my gosh. Please. Open yourself no. to the universe, Commander. Don't touch my mind. Embrace eternity. No! Cyberdyne Models 101 Models 101 Ugh, My head is in the mush Ugh, uh, 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 uh. <laughs> I have given you the cipher Ow. Just as it was given to Saren The ancestral memories of the Protheans are now. part of you now What was that? Commander Shepard, are you alright? She messed me up <laughs> I saw something. Something it still sexy. didn't make any sense. You have been given I a saw gift. Skynet's army. Of an entire Machines. It will Terminators. For your mind Everywhere. To this information. <laughs> we should get you back to the ship, Commander. Medical needs to know about this. Yes. I'm sorry. I was sure suffered, low. But there was no other way. Maybe a root you beer and a, a In long time, it will sleep. help you understand the vision from the beacon. Do you know what the conduit is, or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the Prothean extinction. Then whatever it is, we cannot let him have it. Damn straight, Tally. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it 
Before Saren does. Nah, uh, he'll get to it first. It's always them first. Is there anything else you can tell me about the Thorian? When the creature enveloped me, I became part of it. But I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. It <laughs> transcended all classification. And now it is gone. Don't tell me you feel sorry for that thing. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I am grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. Yeah. I mean, you were bonded with it for a while. I mean, since that's what Alear Tassoni mentioned to me when we talked about the mutual bonds between one another. What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful, I don't know his last he's name. Charismatic. And he is dangerous. That's right. Once I followed he cheats him, at blind chest. to his true nature. But now I see he is leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. He always tells me there's something behind me. Every time I look away, he does something on the chessboard, and and I lose count of where our positions were at. I want to know more about you. There is nothing remarkable about me. Sure there is. I was merely one of Matriarch Benezia's disciples. For nearly two centuries, I followed her, learning at her feet. When wow. Benezia revealed her plan years. to join Saren, she gave her disciples a choice. Only those who were willing had to follow her. Many felt her plan was too dangerous. But I believed in her. I thought she could turn Saren away from his insanity. Instead, we joined him in it. Hmm. Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. I can't let you do that. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank yeah. you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. I hope so. Ah. Uh, I mean, that's gotta be kind of lonely for the Thorian to live that long. Man, it makes me wonder what it was supposed to be like I can't believe it. John what? says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Ah, come here. Okay. I'll just walk this way. Okay, now I can finally turn in these things. Hello! I never thought I would be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined and filtered. What will you do now that the fighting is over? I may stay, try to recover my losses. I can have new supplies delivered within weeks. Perhaps the colony will survive after all. Hmm, what do you Let have me see what you have in stock. Of course. Return in the future, and I may even have more to see. Yeah, maybe. You do have a license for me, and... Look at that! I brought my numbers down! And I can get some more later on <laughs> uh, as I go. Hey, buddy boy, I got your food stock here. And, uh, FYI, be careful what's down there. I think they're up to something. It... What? It doesn't hurt anymore. No, it doesn't. I can think my own thoughts again. And with company money coming in, there's no need to choke down Varen meat. Thanks for everything. We owe you our lives. God, dude. I say, where's those one couples right there? How you doing? Thank you for everything you tried to do here. I'm free. Thank you for giving me my mind back. Look, the guy that's with the, uh... Free. I can't believe I'm free. I remember I had to go back in the tunnel and grab you. To let the people back here let them know there's a man down there. Unless it's still unless that is still an option. I don't know. The only thing I can say for that plan is okay, they're all gonna probably say stuff, yeah. Man. Well at least they got him. 
Let's see, what does those two have to say since I can save them? Where is the other guy? I will do what I can to assist the colony in this difficult time. I am ashamed of the damage done to the lives of these people. Yep, I know about these. Farewell, Shiala. Shiala. Farewell, Commander. That's a I wish name. you well in your hunt. Hunt? It's more of a kill. I fought so hard, but any thought of my own caused so much pain. I know. It ain't easy. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now Exogeny will pour the money in. We'll be able to rebuild and then some. Yeah. That's what that's one thing is already on their way here with supplies. That's one thing that's kinda cool about this game is if you do certain things, everything kinda changes. All traces of the Thorian will be erased in short order. Ferris will have a second chance thanks to you. I think this plan of yours just might work. Well, of course it will. I'm a genius. But yeah, that's one thing. If you do like certain things, if you make out certain mistakes and you didn't and you know you're like, oh shit, I shouldn't done it, you can always reload the game and try again. That's what I kinda did on the Finally. PS3. Damn thing is out of my head. I can think without pain. I still need the power cells for this generator. <laughs> okay. Though. Get on your hands and knees and do not call me daddy, please. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Oh god! Hey. Fidan gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Now if I can kick these power cells into place, I'll have this colony up and running in no time. Mm-hmm. Have you given any thought to helping us with our water troubles? You know, your voice sounds very familiar. I've heard that almost in like every movie and other games. Man, you must be rich as hell and famous as hell. <laughs> the water's back on again. Really? I'll need to get the relays going then. Thanks for your yeah. help, Commander. Here's a yeah. small payment for your trouble. Oh, thank you. Come, Tally Garris. We make our quaints to the Normandy. <laughs> ah, back to normal. Now I totally forgot what the hell I was even talking about because I got sidetracked on something else. Ah, damn. I can't help it. I'm just loving this game because I'm glad it's back. <sighs> I do miss it. I can play the crap out of it. Once more. I mean, I've been playing the crap out of Andromeda, and it's fun. I don't know what anybody's talking about. I haven't had, I have not had any glitch or issues that they showed on when they were talking about, like everyone else would talk about how glitchy it was and stuff. I never had any of those, and so I'm like, God, am I the only one that never had bad experience? Stand like the only thing I only had good glitchiness was the uh, multiplayer. Like that was the only thing I might have had the glitchiness. But other than that, yeah. Commander, you look pale. Oh God, I'm Are white you now. Suffering any ill effects from the cipher? No, but she hit me with a frying pan and stuck a chip in my eyeball. The cipher shook me up a bit. I might be able to help you. I oh am God, not again, perfect. please! If I join, my consciousness no. yours. Maybe we can make some sense of it. Forget it. Keep it to yourself. Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my gosh. Relax, Commander. No. Embrace eternity. That's a little bit better saying than she said. Ow. I don't want to see Skynet in his Judgment Day. Machines rising and destroying humanity. That was incredible. All this oh, time, you. all my research, yet I I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so intense. You are remarkably strong willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Come on, get to the point. What did you see? The beacon on Eden Prime must have been badly damaged. Large parts of the vision are... are missing. The data transferred into the commander's mind is incomplete. Phew. Good thing she didn't look into my personal files of my sexiness. Or sexy stuff. <laughs> you sure you didn't come across any kind of clue or hint? Something we might Don't miss? say that! 
I don't want her doing it I again. Saw, you already know. You were right about the Reapers. The Protheans were destroyed by a race of sentient machines. Terminators. I think it is obvious there is a connection between the Reapers, the Prothean extinction, and the Conduit. But I did not see anything that would help us find it. <sighs> Good thing. Shit. Yeah. I don't want her to I don't want her to see the naughty thoughts of her. <laughs> I don't want her to see those, because then she didn't look into it. <laughs> oh, this was pointless! What's our next move? I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision. What was there at least. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can I can oh. oh god. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go you to lie. the bay and lie down. You for saw it. You looked into my personal folders and files in my brain. Oh no, she saw them. She saw my all my sexy pictures of her and others, and possibly and and, and Tally. Oh god, hope she didn't find that, cause she is my future wife. Hopefully she doesn't get jealous. Doctor Chakwas should take a look at you. That will not be necessary. It is necessary. I, need some I don't want her to. Quiet. I don't want you to find out what I'm up to. Go ahead. We're done here. Dismissed. I've sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Hell no. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander. God damn it. Exogeny should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. What other chances I have, man? You know how hard it'd be to capture that thing? I don't think it's gonna... I don't think a tranquilar... A tranquil... Trank... Ugh. Trank dart was gonna do anything to it. The Thorian liked to enslave mines. Anyone who studied it would have ended up as one of its thralls. Perhaps it's for the best, then. At least the colony was saved. Of course it was saved. Shepard would go to any lengths to help a human colony. That's not true, you dimwit. I'd help your colony, too. Just wait and see. There's still two and three to go. Being human had nothing to do with it. They were in trouble. Admirable. But sometimes specters have to make sacrifices. I hope you're willing to do that when the time comes. Goodbye, Commander. We will be waiting for your next report. What? Not a hug? <sighs> See how mean they are. Such selfish little assholes and brats. <laughs> uh. Well. Um. Hmm. What else do I got? Do -do 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 Oh god, no, 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 I don't want to turn Ellen to jail. Not yet. Yep, I'm back to 99. <laughs> do that, and do that, and uh. Boom, bam. Okay, there we go, if I unlocked it. Okay, now let's check. Um, see, do, 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 do. I got to see, well, that's what I found. Da, 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 da. Go to. Okay. This is the side ones, this is the main ones. That's where I gotta go next. So, uh, Race Against Time, yep. Fan. Da, da, da. This one I think is glitching out. I went to the area and it still says there, there was no ship there. Hmm, I'll go there again. See if it maybe loaded this time. Plus, you get to see the dramatic entrance or exit, I should say. Okay, so where's that? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so he's in this area here. Ha! Uh, I like watching the cutscenes of the Normandy moving around. Of course, it's obviously quite dry and very brown here, or dirt-like. Yeah. I think I'd rather be in more of a greener place. Now see, I checked all the planets and there's still no ship here. I think it's kind of bugged out. That's going to kind of suck. How am I supposed to find this damn thing? Because I checked all the planets. And there's nothing. Oh well. 
Well, I'm gonna end it right there. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to like button, leave me a comment. If you're new and all, don't forget to subscribe and hit that no hit that Normandy bell for Joker for Pete's sake. Cause Joker loves Normandy. Don't you, Joker? Uh, hey, Commander. Next time we touch down, let's try not to park the ship in a colony of mutant zombies. Just thinking out loud here. I gotta go to the restroom, man. I have to go. <laughs> all right, see. <laughs> I have to go. Bathrooms is around here somewhere. I mean, that's the one thing. There, where is the bathrooms? How the hell do we go? I've been all, I've been up and down this ship, and there's not one single. I should. There's not even a like bedrooms for the entire staff. I think that's why the Normandy Mark II is much bigger. That's probably why, because people were like, "How the hell do people sleep? They just stand all around all day, talking schmeck and stuff." But, you know, you gotta start summers. It's gonna be rough, but the game is still fun. I love the story connection. Because that's the one thing. Stuff alternates and changes as you go. That's why I'm like, I don't remember doing that. Because i done something good, not evil, done something good, and now it's completely changed what's in front of me, or ahead of me, and that's why I'm not really remembering it. But, like I said, I'm gonna be kind of a noob at this, because it being remastered, I'm gonna remember vivid pieces here and there. Kind of like what Liara was trying to do to my head. Ugh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't have a problem with that. I just like to goof around. <laughs> but anyway, stay tuned for the next episode. Peace out, everybody. Goodbye. <sighs> it's going to be a blast.